Mike, I'm glad that uh, you've determined that, um, you know, it's very low on your radar. Um, I think that you guys, uh, some of you are, have a bigger concern as, as if this is going to make a bigger impact on your lives. Um, I'm also glad that you understand that there's no fraud going on, um, and that's what upsets me. Um, it's it, it's within my legal rights. Uh, ethically, maybe people will question that, but that's going to always be a matter of opinion. Um, when you start talking that I'm in criminal activity uh, and you're a law enforcement officer, it's it's a little bit uh, of a, a bit of a problem to me. Um, I'm glad here though that you realize that there is nothing going on. Uh, as far as anything that we're doing incorrectly or wrong from a legal standpoint. Uh, yeah, like I just told you, you may have your opinions about my beliefs and who I should use. Um, I'm going to stand on that I have my own opinions, they're mine, um, they're aside from the organization, and as long as I'm not speaking from the podium of the organization, um, then I, I pretty much can say or do anything that I want to. I am a private citizen. Uh, if my colleagues in this industry don't like that, then they can vote me. You know, they can vote me out. They can throw me out. They can do whatever they want to do. Um, I'm always going to speak my mind. I'm going to tell every leader in this industry to speak their mind. Um, no one's going to shut them up. Um, no one's going to bully them. No one's going to use any scare tactics on them. Uh, we're all grown men, very aware of these tactics uh, that are that have been used now. You know, since the internet started, we're not going to fall for them. We're not going to stand for them. We're going to protect our integrity, um, and we're going to stand by the statements that we say. Uh, and we're going to recant and apologize for the ones that we're wrong for. Um, that's just that. That is just it. The uh, you know in a private conversation, I jokingly uh, m made a joke about the Barney Five thing. Everybody knows it's from the Andy Griffith show. Everybody knows that the police officer carries a bullet. He carries one bullet in his pocket. Uh, I apologize to you if that hurts your feelings. Um, it's a joke. Um, maybe it's in bad taste. You know. Uh, however, it wasn't intended to hurt you. Uh, I'm I'm sorry that you're disparaged by that by my actions, um, and are using words like you know they, these are awful and da, da, da. I mean I personally I've I've called people a lot worse. Um, potentially, I may have to apologize for calling people in the future names as well. You know we all get heated up. We all sometimes say things that we don't mean. We're just men. We make mistakes. Um, that's life. That's how things go on. Matter of fact, I'll apologize for anything that I might offend you for in the future. You have a great day. Ron Musgraves, Pressure Washing Window Cleaning Institute out. Not the UAMCC president today. These are my own opinions and my own thoughts. I'm not speaking for the organization. Uh, however, I am the president of the organization and I understand that that comes with a lot of burden because this organization is so ginormous. <laughs> but, you know, I might have a little bit of fun with it, and, you know, that's what we're going to do. We're going to have some fun. We're going to teach these guys. We're going to learn. We're going we're gonna to better ourselves. We're going to better other people, and we're going to better the industry. That's what we're doing here, uh, Mike. That's it. In a nutshell, you know, there's no, there's no grand master plan to take over the universe. But you have a great day, man, and be safe out there. Talk to you later.